Which way? That way. You can technically warp, but let's walk. Bye. Hello, sir. You gotta go out the outside. Every sing- uh oh. Or do you want to be a little man? Every single year, you get troublemakers. That's not even an old person's voice. Ever <laughs> entering how I enjoy scolding them. Anyway, you gotta go out the outside. Follow the fucking rules. What's wrong with you? I'm a rebel. <laughs> without a cause. Uh. Where's my partner? She left. No, I thought that one dude was supposed to be my partner. What dude? The guy who kicked my ass. No! He's your rival. Hello. Oh. Go to that thing. Does this man talk to me? Will no. he play triple triad with me? You have to press square. Watching you guys in action really motivates me. Nope, he will not play triple triad with me. Did you press square? Yeah. Or did you press circle? I pressed square. Oh, okay. Triple triad! I should nope. have asked... I keep wanting to call her Yuffie. That's not Go her to name. That. Triple triad? Oh, you don't have the draw ability yet. That's how you get your magic. Uh, or from, like, other monsters, I think, and stuff, but... Leave him alone! <laughs> <laughs> okay. You're gonna break the game. <laughs> it's fine. Alright, there she is. Will she play a triple dryad with me? Not now, you're busy. Bye. Oh, I can't go anywhere. Is there stuff to pick up in this game at all? Uh, no. Okay. The only thing you, you would pick up is, uh, the magic points. The draw points. You're forgetting your girlfriend! <laughs> Squall, you're forgetting something. You're GF. My girlfriend? <laughs> uh... She wants it to be her. Oh, you got an achievement. Quetzalcoatl! It's your summon. You oh. Don't, you don't have to change its my name. My girlfriend? Yeah, your girlfriend. It's your guardian force. I like the name Quetzalcoatl, but... Should we just... Just keep, keep it Quetzalcoatl? Okay. I don't have any funny name queued up. And you got Shiva. Ooh. Ice bitch. <laughs> I have a few things to explain before we head off. I... The girlfriend gives us <laughs> strength. The stronger the girlfriend, the stronger we become. <laughs> so here's a brief explanation on junctioning a girlfriend. <laughs> Alright, so you go to the junction menu. That's gotta be the title. Be like, the stronger the girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> the stronger you are. Oh, junction, junction, okay. Alright, junctioning. Junction, junction, junction. Jun shut up! <laughs> junction enables characters to power up and use abilities. Uh huh. 420 Shut blaze. up! <laughs> I'm trying to teach you. Okay. I am your sensei. She's talking without me. A girlfriend must be junctioned in order to power up and use abilities. Let's begin by junctioning a girlfriend. <laughs> Right now, no girlfriend is <laughs> junction. <laughs> Forever alone. <laughs> All other commands in the gray cannot be selected yet. So you can only junction. Once junction is selected, GF and match commands appear. Since no GF is junction, magic is displayed in gray. Let's junction a GF. By selecting GF, you can pick Whichever one you want. When did I get Ifrit? The, you, you will get Ifrit. This is just the tutorial menu. Uh, you don't actually have any of these things. But I got Shiva. You do, but like... When tutorial menus pop up, you don't have half the shit that's in it. So, each uh, Guardian Force has their own I thought abilities. I, was, I thought it was a girlfriend. Whatever, <laughs> fuck off. <laughs> I'm trying to explain it for real. Mm -hmm. They each have their own set of abilities and what they have available to them. You have to press the button. Let's choose one. So, I think Quetzalcoatl is the one, yeah. So yeah, so then... It's abilities. Yeah, so whatever stats that it has that comes with it are the ones that you can now junction stuff to, which become your abilities, essentially. Okay. So, yeah. But since there's currently no magic, we will move on to setting abilities. Okay. So, you have to set these things up beforehand, otherwise the only action that you have is attack. Mm. So, and not everyone has the same sort of ability lists to pick from. It's really dumb. So, we have to remember to do this before. 
make you leave. Just click really fast. This is dumb. Abilities. Abilities. Is this not me setting them up? No. Because oh. you have to do it once she's done. <laughs> she's just showing you how to do it. And it's more confusing than it actually is, which is why I had a hard time with it. Okay. But essentially, you're setting up your own command bar. Okay. To fight? Yeah, to fight. And you can pick the order. So, like, not everybody will have, like, let's say, because you only put three in. So mm -hmm. a lot of the times, I'll only have one person have the item, mm -hmm. you know, command. Or not everyone will be able to draw in mm -hmm. a battle. So, so we want draw, right? So draw is good. If you have someone who's not very magically inclined, you could probably throw item instead of draw. Because mm -hmm. um, they probably don't need it. All right. Let's, uh... Let's, let's set it up for real. Once we get to the fire cavern, I'll explain how to junction magic. Use the command draw during battles and stock magic from your enemies. Be sure to have some stocked. Ready to go? The fire cavern used for the test is located east of here. Alright, so go to your menu. Triangle. Oh, I was gonna try to triple try at her, but... No, you can't. She's in your party. Mm. Alright, so go to junk... No, no. Oh, wait. She's still in your party. Okay. Go to Junction. Go to Squall. Uh, Junction. Girlfriend. <laughs> Alright, uh, I would put Shiva on you. And then press circle. Go over to magic. Go down to that. Let's see. I don't think you have anything, but no, you don't. Okay, back up. Back up. Back up. Alright. Now put, uh, I would put your guardian force first, then magic, then draw. And then we can go to that thing and draw, right? Yeah, then you can go back and draw. We don't have any abilities? Yeah, I don't have any abilities yet, so back out. And then, and then go to Keistis. Just, can you go to her yet? No, oh, you have yeah. to put her back in your party. So go draw that magic and then come back. Okay. And then do hers. So yeah, now you can draw. Found a draw point. Cure found. Squall! Yo! Yeah, they got rid of that sound. It makes sound. That's weird. Okay. And you can only draw from it, like, Maybe once. Maybe I should go buy the not remastered one. <laughs> oh, well. All right. <clears throat> All right. Bring her back into your party. Let's go, mother. Ready to go? All right. Now press triangle. Okay. Now set her up as well. Oh, I go to junction? Yeah, you have to go to junction, and you have to uh, give her Quetzalcoatl. And she also doesn't have any magic, so... Just back Wait, out did again. That, yeah. Oops, sorry. Okay. Yeah. Um, there you go. So I would do the same. Give her a draw. Yeah, give her a draw. Okay. All right. Let's get out of here. Blow this popsicle stand. Yeah. All right. You gotta go east. Do you know which direction's east, Ellie? I hope it's this way. You don't have to follow. The no, no, no. That's west. <laughs> oh. You want to go east? Oh no. Well, now you get your first real battle. Oh, no. You can do it. This is active time battle, so you don't really have time to sit there and decide what you want to do. The R1 is the trigger. Yeah, so, like, when he t when he slices, if you hit R1 at the right time, he'll do extra damage. Anyway, just attack. And if you hit R1 at the right time, it does extra damage. Mm -hmm. But yeah, so it's active time battle, so it always is going. Mm -hmm. Are you hitting R1? When do I hit it? Like, now? Yeah. Like, you gotta figure out what the right timing is. It would be fine if you could hear the noise. Where's all the extra noise? Like, her whip crack isn't there. And neither is his sword slice, which is how I always use the time. Mm -hmm. Like, because you can hear, like, the right time to do his, um, sword attack. We'll have to look at the settings. I feel like it can't be something. They better patch that. That's stupid. Mm -hmm. Did we? Yeah, press X. You won. Yeah, see, all that noise is gone. So stunned. I got stoned. All right. So yeah, keep going. Wait. What? Maybe there's something in. No. Sound effect volume. It's at 100%, but there just doesn't, uh... You can just slow down the battle speed if it's too fast for you. No, it was fine. I... Sad. Sad. Alright, you have to go over there. This to the fire cavern. cavern. 
do 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 no. do 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 Also, just so you know, when we get to the fire cavern, it is timed. You have more than enough time to do it, but... So I can't dig around? You can't dig around. You gotta do your battles and... and go. I'm gonna look up. I'm gonna see Am I supposed to hit it, like, first? No, like, hit it on, like, he's on his downswing okay. is usually, like, my go-to. It's hard to tell without the sound. It doesn't do that much extra damage. Like, you don't really need to do it. I never did it. FF9 re HD remaster okay. sound. And you'll know when it does it. Like, it's like a little bit more of an explosion. Hers is harder to get. Where did my mini and other sound effects go? Oops. Oh. So it's just like, I guess... Something about changing the... It's like a bug. Um, and you have to do specific steps to get it back to normal, it looks like. That's lame. Yeah. So there's a way to fix it. We'll fix it for next time. It's fine, yeah. My girlfriend will receive 3 AP. You're taking good care of her. Anything for my girlfriend. Go into the fire cavern. And... I don't like that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, junctioning magic. Now pay attention. I'll be explaining how to use, utilize the magic you have stocked. So you can junction magic uh, to your stats. Which is something I didn't understand you ever needed to change. Because mm -hmm. I was just like, oh, uh, you can, you can just keep clicking through this. Um, but you can, like, oh, you, you, you want to raise the stats to the highest that they can be. But, like, if you put certain magic on certain stats, it changes, like, your attack. I don't know. It gets more complicated. But, so yeah, for example, you equip fire to... The strength stat, mm -hmm. and it ups your stat by one. Um, however, there's no need to junction magic magi manually. Uh, select auto after junctioning, and it'll do it for you. Nice. Um, I always did it manually, but you can do whatever you want. Especially if it's confusing, you just do it auto. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> When you draw a new magic, try experimenting with it when you junction. That's how you become stronger. Okay, ready to go? Oh, you know how to use your gun blade. I, I guess I'll review it. It's better to go over it. <laughs> Alright. The status screen displays each character's basic data. I don't think I've ever touched this screen. Uh, the first mm. status screen shows stats such as HP, strength, etc. The second screen shows all the stats and elemental related information. Oh, I have used this screen. Okay. The third status screen shows girlfriend related information. <laughs> uh, the fourth. Oh, you can turn it on auto. I didn't know this. That's so why you read the tutorials. <laughs> the fourth screen shows the limit break information. Uh, Squall's gunblade settings can be changed in the limit break screen. There's two settings, gunblade auto and Renzo Kuken indicator. Renzo Kuken. Uh, if you select the gunblade auto to on, Renzo Kuken hits automatically without having to press R1. However, a perfect may not be possible with this option. You must select off. And press R1 manually at the right time. Nice. Oh, so that's what that thing is? Yeah. Is turned off. The indicator will not be displayed during Renzo Kuken. If the gunblade auto option is turned on, the indicator is turned off automatically. Great, thanks. That's all for Squall's Limit Break. All right, let's go. 
Time to do your test. Let's go fight these weird twins over there. That's not who you're fighting. Oh. Those are actually like hats. Oh. Yeah, you can't really tell. It Will looks you really play weird. triple try with me? Objective. To obtain a low-level girlfriend, a C <laughs> member must support. Are you ready? Yeah, that's fine. I'm ready. I'm his support. Instructor number 14, Kistis Trep. Select a time limit. Choose one suited to your abilities. Challenging, yet reasonable. Um, I would say for you, I think 20 should be fine. Okay. Very well, good luck. Yeah, see, they're like hats. Thanks, men's. They're weird and their back must hurt. All right, go. Time has begun. 